Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is your boy, DJ Will. Today, I wanted to talk about the Junior case. Um, we got some terrible news. Basically, um, they just basically won a plea deal. Um, the guy that gave Junior the fatal blow, um, like I said, I feel like he should do the rest of his life in jail. You know what I mean? Like, a lot of people don't see it as, like, this could have been any one of our family members. You know what I mean? And, you know, justice got to be served. If they're going to be offering up plea deals, that's bad news all the way around because, you know, now they're going to try to be talking even more, even though that they've been talking, certain people from that group been talking and stuff like that. And, you know, like Sosa, you know, snitching. So maybe people might start talking more. But like I said, guys, it's it's very crazy. Um, I hope that um, you know what I'm saying. He trying to twenty twenty four years, twenty three years. That shit ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? Like you getting scot free if you, you know what I'm saying. If you getting as eligible for parole, you know what I mean. So, like I said, I feel like he should just do the rest of his life in jail. Um, like I said, it's not fair for him to come out. You know what I'm saying? Be a free man. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's crazy. Like, they offering up plea deals. Then they had Stephanie Astacio's brother. He killed, like, two or three people. And he was still running the streets. You know what I'm saying? Nobody knew about that until they put, like, the pieces to the puzzles together. You know what I mean? So, it's just crazy all the way around. Like I said, guys, we have to stand up. Um, we can't let this happen. Um, like I said, it's just crazy all the way around. Justice for Junior. Basically, like I said, he should do the rest of his life in jail. And like I said, the Bronx DA got to get it together because they, they really acting corrupted, man. Like, they really doing shit out of despite. Like, Junior's mom didn't agree to this. So it's basically like, it's just crazy all the way around how they you know, offering up plea deals, like, they shouldn't have no fucking plea deals, like, they should do their time, each person that was involved with it, who set it up, who did the stabbing, who was involved, who was driving in the car, and who was in the scene, all of them should get charged, like I said, they all gonna get charged differently, because some of them are snitching, so, like I said, if more of them open up their mouth, who knows what's going to be. So, like I said, they offering a plea deal, guys. This is very sad news. Um, these people could just do minimum of a couple of years just for a murder. And, you know, people want to really see these guys do life. You know what I mean? Because they are not God. Who are they to take somebody's life? Shouldn't nobody take nobody's life unless God decides to. You know what I'm saying? Like... It's crazy all the way around, guys. I just let me know what y'all think. Um, like I said, um, I'm a hundred percent on Junior's side, of course. Um, I'm gonna most definitely gonna be making my way to the Bronx, New York. Um, pretty soon in the next couple of days, and um, I'm gonna be out there and basically doing like small little videos and um taking pictures and stuff like that out there. And um, I just want y'all to just stay tuned with me. I mean, like I said, this case is crazy. Um, like I said, in every video that I'm going to make of, as far as this case, I'm going to talk about the unknown and some people might get mad. Some people might not agree with me. Well, I just want to put everything on front street. Basically, I just want to just basically put out there that we still don't know about Stephanie Astacio. Like they're not telling nothing about they they trying to switch it up saying that it wasn't no sex video. That's how it got started in the beginning, guys. Don't check the first story is the first one that is exclusive. You stick with that first story. Now they want to have different theories. No, don't have different theories. They trying to say that Junior was involved with the gang. If you in a neighborhood walking up and down and you say, yo, what's up? 
that's not you being involved in the gang, you know what I'm saying? You walking by, you know what I'm saying? They see you, you know what I mean? And you keep it pushing, you know what I mean? That's not being involved with them. They make it seem like, oh, he was involved with them. He wasn't.